see white people waiting on the bus stop, they not mad, they not angry, they just, bus is three hours late, they just, I hope the bus driver's okay. If you see a nigga sitting on the bus stop, we are mad than a motherfucker. It ain't got shit to do with the bus. We just sitting there, just get mad at niggas that's driving, just. Motherfucker atheists done got out of hand. Now they want to tell us what the fuck we believe. You believe in God, so that means you don't believe in science. What the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> Motherfucker, I prayed to God before every science test. I don't know what the fuck you talking about. <laughs> Jesus was in my class, you son of a... Atheist fucked up. Atheist hear my whole story, hear what I believe, then he gonna tell me, nah, that don't make no fucking sense at all. What tell me your shit? His shit is that two motherfucking atoms just came to fuck together. Just came together out of nowhere, banged together, and made this whole perfect earth. Fuck out of here. You stupid enough to believe that fuckboy shit. After this show, go outside to the parking lot and bang on your car till it becomes a better car. You just out there. Just still a Corolla, still a Corolla. What the? Just gotta make your own decisions. They tell you you should not smoke cigarettes because it will stunt your growth. And when you're a kid, they tell you drink all your milk, eat your vegetables, so that you can grow up big and strong. And I remember as a child, drinking milk every day. Just bring a cow in and let me get up under him and drink some fresh milk so I can be big and strong. Broccoli, give me all the broccoli and greens and spinach. Let me show y'all some shit y'all not gonna believe. Would my mother and father please stand up in the audience right now? I'm looking around. Now look up there at my pants up at the top. My daddy 5'5 five, five, and my mama 5'3. What the fuck was I drinking milk for? Shit. I could have been eating lemon heads and baked beans all day. Y'all don't know, it ain't no fun. Cincinnati right now worried about black and white prejudice. That ain't shit compared to the prejudice of being short in American society. This is bullshit. You don't know how I had to overcome. Ain't no parades, ain't no marches. Jesse Jackson don't show up. All the shit y'all take for granted. Like that little thing your mama put by the door to mark your size every year. We just had one dark ass line. My mama won't forget about it on the top of it, just one dark. Then you grow up and be the same size. You got to be a pimp. You just can't be no regular nigga this size. I can't even go to an amusement park. Fuck King's Island, I don't give a fuck. I'm a grown ass man, what do you mean I can't ride this goddamn ride? I'm a grown ass man. Spent a hundred dollars, I gotta ride in a teacup with little kids. Just, this is bullshit. When we get out this motherfucker, I'm gonna kick your motherfucking ass. I'm enjoying my motherfucking life. That's all I'm saying. I advise you to do the same. Do shit that make you happy. Go out and get you some white friends. Get you some white motherfucking friends. You ain't gotta sleep with them, but you gonna need them motherfuckers. If you go to jail and call your nigga friends, these motherfuckers will interrogate you more than the goddamn police did. <laughs> they had your ass on the phone. Where the fuck was you at? What the fuck was you doing? Why the fuck you ain't call me? Not your white friends. Them motherfuckers will be there by the time you hang up the phone and they'll be madder than you. Just what the fuck did he do? Murder, murdered who? Look, I fucking known him for two weeks. He wouldn't fucking do something like that. <laughs> Gotta love white people. I don't give a fuck what you say. White people are friendly. You can call them motherfuckers up at three o'clock in the morning with the wrong number and they won't even be mad at you. They just, brrr, hello? No, I'm sorry, no Shaquita here. Well, what number did you dial? No, it's a nine, not a seven. We'll try it. If it doesn't work, call me back. We'll figure this thing out. We gotta love white people. It's thanks to white people we know anything about wild animals. You realize that niggas have never in the history of niggerdom discovered a wild animal. Not one, not a wild pit bull, nothing. Cause we too cautious. Niggas don't discover shit. We don't get close enough to discover. Niggas take no chances. That what nigga, is that a Rottweiler or a bear? Nigga, go, go, no, go, fuck that, go. go. White people though, let me say this. Y'all need some nigga friends. Get you some nigga friends. Just don't ever, ever call them your nigga friends. Don't ever, that'll fuck the relationship up. There's my nigga friend. You guys say it all the time. What? 
White people, you need your nigga friends so they can tell you when shit is not appropriate. First of all, white people, please stop putting them little blue leashes on your children. Please stop doing that. That is only entertainment for niggas. That's all that is. We be excited to the motherfucker. Look at him, look. That's why white kids grow up and kill everybody in the goddamn school because you done treated them like a German shepherd ever since they were three. They be in the store like, oh, I want them. I mean, even though he's my friend, these niggas still retarded. Stupid than a motherfucker. This motherfucker got enough money to be whatever the fuck he want to be his whole life. But what the fuck does this nigga want to be? A goddamn sheriff. You can't be no goddamn sheriff, Shaq. You are 18 foot, 6 foot, 12, nigga. How the fuck? You can't even go undercover. Just do you have any drugs? No, Shaq. That's your motherfucking ass. You a dumb motherfucker if you let Shaq pull you out the car. You just, could you step out the car? Nigga, could you make a free throw? Then I'm not getting out there. I'm just not gonna do it. If you want that nigga not to shoot you, you gotta dress up like a basket. He can't shoot them. He can't shoot baskets. He can't do it. Whole world is fucking crazy. You don't know what to trust. You can fuck around and stay away from gangbangers and drug dealers and still get killed by a squirrel. <laughs> you gotta try to act like it wasn't a squirrel. You... Oh shit, nigga, don't tell my mama it was a squirrel, nigga. Don't tell my mama it was a squirrel. Tell that nigga shot me with two small bullets in the neck. Tell her. It wasn't a 22, it was an 11. Bitch shot me with an 11. <laughs>